So how are you today? Excellent, no complaints whatsoever. It's day Welcome one back. Con. Uh, it's always a good vibe here. Uh, amazing fan experience. Everyone, everyone here is cool, supporting their shows, supporting everyone involved. So energy here is great. This is your second year, right? Second, yeah, second year. So are you more prepared last, this year? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what I, I can expect. Like I know what to expect this year. Uh, last year for me, I was so nervous. Everything that I walked into, I was so nervous. Um, I think I also wasn't prepared for the caliber. Um, you know the size, Everything. the magnitude yeah. of an event like this. People had told me stories, but I just kind of, I didn't really believe it. And yeah. Comic Con in San Diego, at least, is truly like an experience that you uh, you have to see to believe. So this year, I'm, I feel much more comfortable. I know what's coming. I know what to expect. So I'm just here having a good time. And everyone's surprised to see you because last time we saw you on screen, you were dragged to hell. Yes, I was. So what can you tease about this season? Um, well, I can state the obvious. I get out of the hole. Yeah. Scrape my way back from hell. Uh, there's a lot of things that we get to explore with the uh, there's a new dynamic. Uh, we get to see somebody that's hit rock bottom, and we get to see how it's going to change him and his character. I think there are going to be new elements involved behavior-wise. I think there's a facade that he's still going to play up to maintain this tough guy, badass image. But I think we're going to see a guy on the road to redemption, uh, and, and you know we'll see how that plays out. Okay, cool. I'm great. excited to see it. It's going to be fun. Thank you. How are you? Good. How are your first Comic Con? Yeah, pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. Do you like it so far? I do. Have you seen like fans and anything? Yeah, uh, some at the hotel. Um, yeah, but I'm, I'm actually excited. We got the panel today, so that's my first panel ever. So, that's yeah. exciting. Are you nervous? A little bit, but it's like good, good nervous energy because it's a really exciting time and it's, it's really surreal. I'm just taking it all in. All right, so let's talk about Mason really quickly. Yeah. So when you came onto the show, did you expect him to have such a big role? No. Important. Well, super important. I mean, it was hinted that I was, I was. Like, set out to be like a Styles 2.0, mm -hmm. kind of like a Styles to, to Liam. And, and, you know, it was, it was. I had expectations, but they definitely were exceeded. Just based off of it's such a, it already has such a huge following. <laughs> to be a part of it and then to just accept me so quickly is just amazing. Because I was in like the first, in like season four, I was in like, I think like six or eight episodes and now I'm in almost all of them on this season. So it's, it's just awesome. It's definitely been progressing and a great character. Yeah, it's great to see you out there. I really like watching you. Yeah, thank you. And then um, with your music or like your playlist and stuff, yeah. I love your playlist. Thank you. you put them on Twitter. Do you have like a playlist that you set in stone before you play Mason or like? That's actually a good question. I don't. I've always wondered like what kind of music Mason would like, and I don't want to be like just make it so easy like he'd like the same music I do because I'm pretty sure there's some music that he likes that I don't know. But I, I don't have like a real good playlist for him. I, I, I use playlists actually for like really emotional scenes. Yeah. So I did use one. I had an emotional scene season six. Um, it's the only one. It, 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 it definitely. Yeah. It definitely worked. Okay. I'm excited. I'm excited to see it. Thank You're directing something this year. Fucking hell yeah. Or like a lot. You do a lot. I'm directing a bunch so. of stuff. I'm doing a so many, so many things. So with directing, what are you most nervous about for doing it for Teen Wolf? Ooh, most nervous. I'm, honestly, I'm not that nervous. You just got it all. Uh, I'm most nervous about maybe, maybe, maybe talking to my fellow actors and giving them notes. You know, saying, "Hey, uh, I really like that, but let's try it this way." I'm trying to like figure out how to um, not sound like an asshole or sound not, like not sound like an asshole, but also also give notes that that they can understand so that it's not confusing. Like, there's a certain way that you're supposed to give notes. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, there's like, a very fine line between giving a note and giving a line reading. You yeah. never want to give an actor say like you never want to say them, say to them, "Hey, do it like this." Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say, try it, try it with this idea or with this, inf not inflection, but like have this thought in your head or something like that. Um, so it's gonna be interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm definitely a little nervous about that. But again, I love these people, and it should be no no problem. It should be really fun, and I'm, and I'm most excited about just like having control.